Howdy, y'all. So on the hot days, the chickens appreciate a little bit of water. And watch this. You see the hose over there? Comes over this way, goes this way, goes over way. Here's the little where they connect. All the way over here. Green water catchment center. See how much water we gathered from the last one. And none. None. But we got one. One barrel of water. So all we do is take the hose and you drop it in the other barrel of water. Make sure it's at the bottom because it will float. All right, so what you do is this uh, hose is already pre-primed already to this. So basically, you don't want to lose any water from this hose, although it's dry. It makes it a lot easier. And this is the water. This is the hose that goes to the tank over there. And what you do is you blow in it. You don't suck in it. You don't want to drink that stuff. Blow in it, you create a bubble, and then when the water flows over the edge of the bucket, it creates a vacuum, and then it pulls more water. Alright, you wait for it to hiccup a few times, so don't splash it there. Right there. Just all good. You don't get everywhere. I don't have a pump. And with a little bit of brains, you don't need one. You can see all the chickens, they ran straight to it. I do this every couple days, especially when it's hot. You see them all over there getting that water. They put their feet in it. They don't really lay in it, but they, uh, they like it to help them cool down. But then they also will dig in those spots and get the bugs and the worms and everything that comes up. But they'll get about 50 gallons of water. See that one? She's sitting there drinking. You see? Yeah, sitting there drinking it. It's real cold water, too, because it's just been sitting in that tank out of the sun. So they're happy to get it. I mean, they got water just right there, but that's probably a lot warmer. Definitely stagnant, too. It's been sitting there for you know, since yesterday. But there's the fresh water. Let's get in for a closer view here. They love it under the willow tree. 